That's what I want to become. I want to become someone that lives this kind of life. And that's where the solution lies. I want to invite some calls as we have this conversation on 011-883-0702. For me, probably one of the most important conversations this country needs to have. How to give the boy child who becomes the young man, who becomes the older man, a sense of direction and purpose. I think it's probably the most important conversation this country has to have. Yeah. And, and not only this country, but I suppose the whole world. I think that there is a, a crisis of identity in as far as maleness is concerned. Oh, and and, and, I, and I'll, I'll even go as far as arguing that that then, that then creates a crisis in just general identity. Yeah, but for both men and women. Uh, okay. and, I, and I'd love and I'd love and I'd love to get some calls from our listeners as they hear this conversation. I I had a call, and I just can't forget this call. It was from a woman, by the way, uh, and her name was Liesel. And she said, she's an attorney, she said, she said, what she has learned is that um, the father, uh, the mother introduces the child to themselves through the idea of unconditional love. And that the father introduces the child to the world through conditional love. So that's why I laughed a little bit when you said that we're just not bad enough. Um, and, and, I, and I didn't get the sense that you were trying to say we've got to be bad as in immoral and, and unethical. We, we've got to be a little harder. And I'm a father myself of the two sons and I've come to understand the complementary role that my wife and I play in the raising particularly of our sons, but also our daughter, right? So we're three children. Yeah. And what I've come to understand is that moms provide the idea that there is this idea of unconditional love. And then there is the interest.